everyone, welcome back to the QC Makeup Academy YouTube channel. My name's Stephanie and I make videos for this channel every month. And today's video is going to be mainly focusing on the eye makeup look inspired by St. Patrick's Day, of course. So happy St. Patrick's Day. I'll be showing you a full face tutorial as well, but we are mainly gonna be focusing on the eye look because I feel like it's a bit quirky, it's a bit wacky, but it's all the greens and golds, so that's what we're aiming for today. So if you'd like to see how I created this whole face tutorial, then keep on watching. First I'm going to prime my face using the Too Faced Hangover Primer. Next I'm going to take some sellotape and I am just going to pop some on the sides of my eyes to create a really nice sharp line. First, for my transition shade, I am going to be taking this colour from my QC Makeup Academy eyeshadow palette and I'm just going to blend that into my crease. Next, I am going to be taking this shade right here, mixing it with this one, so the colours together, for my outer crease. Next I'm going to take some concealer to go over my lid and then apply a lid colour and the concealer I'm going to be using for this is the Urban Decay Naked Skin Concealer. And the lid colour I'm going to be taking for this, I'm going to be mixing in this gorgeous yellowy gold shade with this yellow and there's a really nice gold there so we're going to mix them all together and it's a really nice gold. I'm going to go in with a darker green now, so I'm going to be taking this shade right here and mix it in with this one that we used before, just to darken it up a little bit more. I'm going to add in a little gold liner addition now onto my lid and this is by uh, Makeup Gallery Chick Flick Eyeliner and this is a really nice shimmery gold shade. So with this I'm simply adding a nice gold little touch. Next I'm going to be taking some black eyeliner and again this is by Makeup Gallery, this is just your standard black eyeliner and I'm just going to go over my lid and create a nice little flick at the end as well. Just having a little tidy up and then I can progress with my face makeup and then I can finish off my eyes. Concealer for my under eyes I'm going to be using today is a Race Pace by Benefit. And the foundation I'm going to be using is the Charlotte Tilbury Magic Foundation. Taking it on my Real Techniques Miracle Complexion Sponge. I like doing my eyes first so I can fix any mistakes. And to conceal under my eyes, I'm going back in with the Urban Decay and Naked Skin Concealer. 
Taking my sponge again. And I'm gonna bake underneath my eyes using the Laura Mercier translucent powder. Next I'm going to bronzer and blusher my face. So for bronzer I'm going to be taking the QC Contour Powder Palette and as some of the contour shades are absolutely gorgeous and fantastic for bronzer, I think I'm going to be taking this middle shade right here. And then going in with my QC blusher powder palette I'm going to be taking this gorgeous coral shade right here. Next I'm going to do my brows and I have got this dip pomade from Makeup Revolution. I'm going to powder the rest of my face now, going in with a powder brush and the Laura Mercier setting powder. Next for highlight, I'm going to be taking the QZ and Makeup Academy highlighter palette and I think I'm going to go for the gorgeous shade Luna, which is this really nice white yellowy shade. Very pretty. And I'm going to go crazy with it because she can never have too much highlighter. Go down the nose, above the brow. That is a gorgeous highlighter colour. I'm gonna take that highlighter shade in the inner corners of my eyes as well. And a tiny bit under the brow arch. So we're going to add a light green shade that I used for the transition colour for my crease, this one right here. And I'm going to apply that underneath my lash line and then I'm going to apply a nice bright green liquid eyeliner. So this is the NYX Vivid Brights liquid eyeliner and this is in the shade of Vivid Envy. Okay, now it's time to put some lashes on. The lashes that I've got are the Ardell Baby Wispies. So I'm just gonna go off camera, pop these on, and then finish off with some mascara. Lashes are all on. They are very, very, very natural and small. I found, because obviously the eye look is a bit bold and crazy, I'm gonna go for a nice natural full slash, but I am just gonna set them in place with the new Benefit Bad Gal Bang Mascara for my bottom lash and obviously my top ones. So. Gonna set my face using the Kat Von D Lock It Setting Spray and then I'm just gonna pop some gloss on my lips. And the gloss I'm gonna be using today, I didn't want anything too heavy again like uh, with the lashes. So I've got the NYX Butter Gloss in the shade uh, Madeline, Madeline. Madeline Madeline is a really nice subtle nude lip gloss and if you know me, you know I love a nude lip.
And that is the finished look, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up. But don't forget to subscribe to the QC Makeup Academy YouTube channel. And I'll see you for a brand new video next month.